Monday to you and thank you for joining us for this video meditation. In Romans chapter 8 verse 5 there is this, those who live according to the flesh set their minds on the things of the flesh, but those who live according to the spirit set their minds on the things of the spirit. Where we set our minds, where we zero dial in our focus mat matters tremendously for our accomplishing our purposes in life. People have been studying what makes elite athletes at the top of their game. And one of the things they've been studying is the mental processes. One of the mental processes that has been picked up is what is called the quiet eye of some of the world's best athletes. It is a way in which they eliminate distraction and enhance their perception. So for example, there's a kinesiologist named Dr. Joan Vickers who has studied the world's best putters. And the world's best putters keep their eye on the ball most steadily and longest both before they hit it and as it runs off of their putter. This helps them to not be choking, not be uh, half-minded, but to give their best. As we want to experience God's best, we need to give our best to experiencing it. And that's a great illustration for today. We were supposed to be having our fifth annual golf tournament for Rising Tide. We weren't able to do it in person, but we are doing it virtually. And it's an opportunity for people, even though they can't be on the golf course, to keep their eye focused on what it really is about. And that's impacting the life of a young child. So we encourage you to keep your eye focused. Even when things around you change, and you may not be able to do it as you once did, things can still happen. Stay focused, watch, and act. As they say, the main thing is to keep the main thing the main thing. So keep your eye on Jesus and everything else will work out really good. God bless you and have a great day. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.